You took your classes, you passed your test, and hopefully on your first try. Well, you maybe or maybe not have your real estate license yet, and you maybe or maybe not have passed your test yet. Well, let me tell you, it's never too early to start thinking about which brokerage you're going to work with. Now, I have talked to many agents. I've talked to agents in the industry a long time, got their two cents on their brokerage, their experiences. I've had a grandmother who has bounced between almost every single local brokerage. And I've talked to agents who have their license or are just about to pass or take their test, hopefully they pass it, and they have no idea what brokerage they're gonna pick. They don't even know the difference. And when I was studying for my real estate license, I learned in the course that you actually have to have a brokerage. I thought that you could get your license and go do whatever you want. So. Basically, if you're going to be a real estate agent, it's essential that you pick a brokerage. It's required by the law, but it's essential that you pick a brokerage that works for you. So today we're going to talk about how to pick your real estate brokerage. Now make me a deal. If you get any value or information from today's video, hit that like and subscribe button. My name is Grace Roberts. I'm a licensed real estate agent here in the greater Springfield, Missouri area. And if you'd like to learn more about real estate, I've just, since I've got my license now and I've been having a finance YouTube channel, I'm going to be coming out with an entire huge mega series teaching people how to make money in real estate and kind of vlogging my process and my wins and losses along the way. So if you're interested in a career in real estate or just are interested in it, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. Now, everybody's situation is gonna be a little bit differently because every brokerage is a little bit different. They're all roughly the same, so it's not that big of a deal, but it is, and we'll talk about it. So depends on what you have locally. The brokerage I chose to work with for my real estate business is Keller Williams. We've got Mernie, we've got Remax, we've got a bunch of little kind of mom and pop boutique local shops. And I chose Keller Williams for a few reasons. I'll make a, we'll talk about it here in a second, but I'll make a, an entire video on why I picked Keller Williams as my brokerage later, because there's a lot of information there. Point being is there's probably a lot of options. And those options, depend on where you're located. And like I said before, it's a big deal to pick the right brokerage, but at the same time, it's not. Now listen, if you join a brokerage and you hate it, you can switch. Now it is a hassle, so this is why it's a big deal and it's not. If I hated Keller Williams a year from now or even tomorrow, I can switch brokerages and start working with someone else. However, my email, my app, my website, my business cards, my online marketing, Everything I've created will have to be made new with the new branding, either if I do it on my own or if I do it with the other brokerage's branding. I like to use the Keller Williams branding. Well, not really branding, but their services, you know, their pre-made websites, apps, marketing materials, stuff like that. You know, my address is gracemoreroberts at kw.com. I could use a different email address, but I like it. So I can switch whenever I want, but it would be a major hassle and cost me money if I did that. Before we go any further, I gotta tell you about the sponsor of today's video. Now don't fast forward through it because this one you're gonna wanna listen to, and I'll tell you why. Usually on YouTube, the YouTuber pitches you a brand deal, and then if you're interested, you potentially buy it. Well, this is the other way around. Today's video is sponsored by Weeble, my favorite online stock brokerage on the planet. I've been using them for many years and I've never paid them a dime. It is free, free to download, no subscriptions, no commission trading, it is absolutely free. And better yet, they're gonna pay you to sign up in the form of a sign up bonus. And right now they're celebrating their fourth anniversary. So they're gonna give you four, no, 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 six free stocks valued all the way up to $2,600 plus $5 worth of free crypto if you open a free crypto account with them. Listen, I'm gonna say this again. Six free stocks valued all the way up to $12,600. The last stocks I got were worth about $60 a piece. So this is free money. And here's how you unlock it. All you gotta do is click the link in my description, download Weeble, create an account, deposit as little as just one cent into your account. So that way, you know, you connect your account, they deposit all the stocks in there. You can either sell them for cash and cash them back out into your bank account. You can uh, sell those specific stocks and buy the dip because the market's pretty low right now. So it'd be a perfect opportunity to do that. You can do literally whatever you want. They're free stocks. Yours is good as cash. I always just cash mine out, but you can do whatever you want. So thanks to Weeble for sponsoring today's video. 
Yeah, let's get into more details about picking a brokerage. So each brokerage kind of has their little benefits and little programs and stuff like that. And one of the big reasons I decided to go with Keller Williams is because they actually decided to, uh, well, they didn't decide to, if you attend their seminar, and I don't know if it's like this in your local market center, if you have a Keller Williams market center in your area, but here in Springfield, Missouri, I attended their seminar, lasted about an hour. It's meant for people who were thinking about a career in real estate. And uh, they paid for my 72 hours of pre-licensing education for Missouri. And that was a $450 value. So that was one of the major benefits. And I'll make a video soon talking about the entire cost of starting a real estate business. But Keller Williams, one of their things is they want the lowest barrier to entry as possible. They don't believe that uh, you should be paying franchise fees and all this other stuff as a big upfront cost. So when doing my research, Keller Williams had one of the lowest financial barrier to entry. And when I joined Keller Williams, they paid for my education, but they didn't pay for uh, my, you know, MLS fee. They didn't pay for me joining the board of realtors or anything like that. Now I've heard of some brokerages that will pay some of your fees for you while offering zero other free support. And I've heard of brokerages that pay absolutely nothing and they give you free support. For example, Keller Williams, they paid for my pre-licensing education, but they didn't pay for absolutely anything else, but they have some of the best free training. And in fact, I just got done with a training session online Monday, Wednesday, Friday, about two hour sessions online. They're fantastic and that's free. So you have to do research and go to the websites of your local brokerages and call around and ask agents in your area exactly what are the pros and cons of joining their brokerage? What do you like? What do you don't like? And then compare. Okay, so here's the deal and here's what you're really going to need to do. I reached out to all of the agents I know in my direct kind of uh, personal life, family, friends, maybe family members. I reached out and that's what I did. And then I asked them, what brokerage do you work with? And what do you like about them? What don't you like about them? And what have you heard about other brokerages? Because here's the thing, real estate agents know other real estate agents and they talk about, you know, what they like, what they don't like about their brokerage and stuff like that. Like I said, my grandmother worked for very many local brokerages here while she was a real estate agent. So I got a lot of very, very good information. Now, here's the thing. That grandmother, she used to work with Keller Williams. She hated it. They said they had no free training. Well, now they have a ton of free training and she switched to learning. She liked that much better. So you've got to make sure that the information you're getting is updated. She's not a current real estate agent. She was a real estate agent many, many years ago. So it's best to ask people who are current real estate agents. And that's where you're going to get the best information. Another thing I did, for example, I typed in Keller Williams career. You can type in Murney career whatever it might be, all of the big brokerages will have a career page. And basically you can see what the pros and cons are of joining their brokerages and compare it to different websites. Now it's always best to get a first hand um, review from a real agent. But for example, when I typed in of uh, Murney careers or Kelly Williams careers, you know, they give you all of the information, how much it's going to cost your monthly fees, the splits, the splits of course is very important things that come with it. You get branded apps, do you get branded you know, you know, technology, what do you get with joining this brokerage? Do you get free training? Do you get to join a team? What is it? You got to just weigh them out. And for example, one of the real estate agents I reached out to, I was like, Hey, what brokerage does your business work with? And she said, Murray, she said that her market center, it's a 60, 40 split. That's what they start you. You keep 60% of your commission up to a $30,000 cap. Don't quote me on this, but just kind of an example. Pretty sure this is what it is. 60 40 split till a thirty thousand dollar cap then you go to a 70 30 split then once you hit that cap you keep 70 percent of your commission now keller williams starts you at a 70 30 split you keep 70 percent of your commission day one and then until a twenty thousand dollar cap then you keep 100 percent of your commission and that was really the only brokerage that i knew had a split that just started you out 70 30 and then would be willing to give you 100 percent after 20k and their whole philosophy is the top agents and the bottom agents, everybody's worth about 20 grand a year to us. So they don't play favorites. And that's one of the things I really liked about Keller Williams, of course, was the splits. I'd love to keep 100% of my commission. And I'm sure you would too. So splits is something very, very important. In fact, it was on the top of my list when deciding which brokerage I wanted to pick. I don't care about training. I read books. I watch YouTube videos. I can learn on my own. Training wasn't that big of a deal. Luckily, they have fam awesome training. I've been in their training sessions for weeks now, and I really enjoy them. Some brokerages, you know, they only want you to pick up the phone and cold call. They only want you to deal with buyers. Kelly Williams doesn't care. You can do whatever you want. You own your business. You just have to operate under the brokerage's supervision by law. So I really like the freedom. I literally, the only thing I do is I went in for the onboarding process. I'm like, all right, cool. Good to go. We'll let you know when your license gets back in the mail. 
and then literally just run my business. And here are some of the questions, you know, maybe write down on a Google Doc or piece of paper these questions, the essential questions you want answered, and then write columns, Keller Williams, Murney, local brokerage, whatever it might be, ABC Realty, and then check the boxes on the stuff that they have and don't have. For example, a list of questions you might ask is, um, uh, what are the splits? What are the monthly costs? Are they gonna force you to maybe only deal with buyers or do open houses at first? How is the freedom? What technology benefits do they offer? Do they give you pre-made agent websites, apps, email addresses, business cards, marketing materials, free headshots, and how good is their training? And more importantly, is it free? Those are all of the questions that you should write down and compare to all of your brokerages. Now, keep in mind, the absolute best reviews you can get is from firsthand agents, people who are actually working there and talking to other agents and what their experiences are. For example, my dad's got some buddies, and for years, it was a father-son real estate business operating under Murney. Well, the second that the dad passed, the son switched it to Keller Williams. So, you know, it's just everybody has their different opinions. Some people don't want to waste time rebranding or, or changing their brand and email addresses if they have whatever it might be. Do your research, send some Facebook messenger or email messages out and um, check some websites. You should get all the information you need probably within a day. Now, I am curious, what brokerage do you either work for now and what do you think of them? Or what brokerage are you thinking about joining? I'm genuinely curious. It's kind of a big decision and there's so many options out there. And you know, maybe you have ABC Local Realty and they offer you 80, 20 splits till 10K. Let me know who you're gonna work with and why. I'm genuinely curious. And if you have any more questions about becoming a real estate agent or maybe even Keller Williams, um, definitely reach out either in the comments below or Grace Roberts at kw.com. I can help you out. If you're looking to buy, sell, or invest in the Springfield, Missouri area, you know who to call. And if you're not in my area, but you're looking to find an agent, the top agent in your area for the neighborhood you're looking to buy, hit me up because I can refer you that exact person you're looking for worldwide. Anyway, guys, don't forget to sign up for Weeble. Get those six free stocks valued all the way up to $12,600 for their fourth anniversary, plus $5 with free crypto. And hold you into the deal up. If you got any value or information on today's video, hit that like and subscribe button. I greatly appreciate it, and I will see you in the next real estate video.